one of the toughest guys at OBJJ. Very, very uh, motivated, Roman. 100 years old. <laughs> what do you have to say for people that are doing jiu-jitsu at an old age? That's the best thing they could do. That's the best medicine. Get your ass up and come on over here. And that's going to be your best medicine. You never have to go see the doctor. You ain't got to spend that money because he's not going to make you better. This makes you better. Come over here. We got your medicine right here. How old are you? 65. And how many years have you been doing this? Uh, 40. That's a long time. 40. Look, you ever see any 40-year-old with guns like that? Look. You recorded that? <laughs> That's Roman for you guys. We gotta find a Juliet for him. <laughs> So we are here at Curate, one of my favorite places, and today I um, went to one of my friend's companies. Um, her name is Amy. She's selling mooncakes. They just called me for my drink. Thank you. Yeah, I got it. Thank you. We got the Tiger Latte. We got the Tiger Latte here. We got the Midnight Charcoal Taro Espresso. And right behind me is the Lion's Dance performances. They did really awesome. Um, one thing with the Lion Dance that I know of is that they scare away evil spirits or bad luck. And coming in here with the new um, Moon Festival coming up, perfect, perfect timing. We got Amy Mooncakes here. Shout out to Amy. We got the ube, the ube moon cake. Kind of looks like a lion itself. We got this one as well. I think this one's taro. I'm not sure. But this one, they have really, really good flavors. And if you guys want the best moon cakes, Amy Moon Cakes is one of the best here in Orlando. We have the matcha. Actually, the flavors are in the back. So we're going to have some matcha. Have some taro, 
ube. Hi. She has one of the best mooncakes in Orlando. What made you want to start mooncakes? Honestly, I saw it on social media and I was like, I can do this myself. And honestly, there were no places in Orlando that did snow skin mooncakes. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to do it myself. And like, I was just so thankful to get so much support and love from the Orlando community afterwards. Kind of like blew up. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, thank you.